I simply refuse to believe that there is any difference between you and I. My hope is you inspire to follow your dreams, no matter what they might be. I am here to prove to you that dreams do come true, and all you have to do is take that first leap. The whole flight aspect of it, that's that's what I'm chasing, that's what I'm after. It is a pretty risky and dangerous uh, sport, but it's well worth it. I started flying seven years ago, six years ago, and I have probably roughly about 1,800 jumps total. Highest I've been is like about uh, 17,000 feet, 18,000 feet. Lowest I've done is roughly around 300 and something feet. I say the most dangerous time so far has been uh, recently when we were shooting that commercial. It was it was a very low building that we did our wingsuits off of and we did it in like a multi way. So we did it with multiple people. When you get lower, it's just your reaction times have to be faster. There's a lot less room for error. You're just shrinking down your margin for error because if you're up at 13,000 feet, then you have a lot of time to react. You have a lot of time to figure things out if something happens. But when you're at, you know, 840 something feet, and that's when you're just starting to jump off, it's just way quicker response times. You just have to be on your A game. The latest like big adventure that we did was went down to Panama and jumped off some buildings and some wingsuits and flew through the city, skyscrapers and all that. Chose the skyscrapers just because of it's so rare to, to be able to afford that opportunity to go fly in the city. Um, Cause our sport is illegal in most of the places uh, that we want to fly. So um, Panama was one of the great cities where they allowed us to come down. A beautiful city with huge skyscrapers everywhere, so we can literally just fly right in between all of them and, and have a good time. Feels uh, fast and furious for sure. I'm literally scared every time I do it. I know me in particular, I'm terrified of heights. Um, if, if actually you and I were standing at the edge of a cliff, I can almost guarantee you that you're, that I'm going to be more scared than you are. It's just, that's just my dream is to fly. So unfortunately, it's one of those things you have to get over and you have to conquer that fear. I'm overriding it because I've spent years and I've dedicated years and thousands of jumps to the sport. It's like a lot of people think it's very high energy and you're, and you're amped up and no, it's, it's actually complete opposite. You're just really calm, you're relaxed, you know, you're living in the moment. I think all of us wingsuiters, we have this, we start with this dream of like jumping off of a building and like flying like a bird. Next plan, uh, me and my cameraman, we're gonna go to Europe. We're gonna spend some time up in the Alps and uh, do some more jumps. China would be awesome. Um, um, I know that you guys have some beautiful cities there and some beautiful skyscrapers. Honestly, I don't even think I could put one city as like the place I'd want to go. I think I'd want to travel all over China and get all this jumping done.